peace in God, and the enemy be at peace with you. Amen. Because the enemy cannot distract you. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. Because you don't want to do everything to please God. Amen. And that means you're going to have some peace. Amen. Because you're doing what? Things to do what? To please the Lord. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Mm, thank you, Jesus. Mm. Knowing that whatsoever good thing any man do it, the same shall he receive of the Lord, whether he be born or free. And ye master, do the same thing unto to do them, forbearing, threatening, knowing that your master also in heaven, neither is there respect a person with him. Amen. I'm so glad he don't have a respect a person. Amen. Glory be to God. I'm so glad that, that the Lord loves us. Amen. And he does not have a respect of a person. Amen. Because if we are walking in the will of God. Amen. And doing what the word called us to do. Amen. Pray to God. You know. A amen. You know. God love us. Amen. Glory. He don't have respect a person who he may do things for. Amen. Because what he do for me, he'll do for you. Amen. Why? Because we are walking in the will of God. Amen. Glory. Mm, God, I thank you. Thank God for his word. Now, this is where I want to get to because I had to get to there to get to this point. The Bible said, finally, because mm, I had to get to down to that point. It said, finally, mm, my God, my God, finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. I had to get that. So, after you done, see, after the children obeying their parents and the Lord and Honor their father and their mother and keeping God commandment. Amen. Glory be to God. And, and thou limit long as on the earth and father not provoking their children to wrath. Amen. And the servant obey the servant being obedient to their master. Amen. Glory be to God. After going through all day and doing the thing, the will of God and to please in God, to walk in the will of God and please in God. Amen. He said, family, my brother. After I've done all of that, you done done all of that. I want you to be strong in the Lord and the power of His might. Mm. Why would He say after you know after look after you being obedient to your parents and you honor your father and mother and the servant pleasing their master? Amen. Glory be to God. Why would He want us to be strong in the Lord and the power of His might? Why? Finally, he said, after doing all that you done doing, he said, the final thing I want you to do, because the final conclusion after you done done all that, the final decision after you done done all that, mm, the last thing after you done done all that, mm, after you done the final thing, not to be altered, mm, mm, not to be changed. Don't change a thing. After doing all that you done done, don't change anything. Mm. At the end of all of that, everything you done done, everything you done done to my word, according to my word, huh? and according to my will and my plan, this is what I want you to do. Mm. Finally, mm. This is because it's the end of him. My brother, be strong in the Lord. Mm. Be strong. Paul said, be strong in the Lord. You got to be strong in the Lord. Why? And put, and, and, and in the power of his might. Why? Put on the whole armor of God mm, that you may be able to stand against the wild of the devil. Now, see, Paul said, after you done done all that you done done, I want you to be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Because, look, there's some things about to take place. There's some things about to come up against you. Because have you noticed that every time, glory to God, hallelujah, when you try to do the will of God, when the Lord give you an assignment for something for you to do, he gives you something to do. Don't you know that the enemy going to come and he's going to attack you with that same thing the Lord has given you to do? Amen. So Paul says, after you know, after you know, after because you honor your mother and your father and you obey your parents, amen, and servant, pleasing their master, he said, I want you to put on the whole armor of God because the enemy is going to come up against you. What's going to happen? He said, mm. he said, put on the whole armor of God. I want you to put God's arm on. I, look, I want you to, you got to cover up yourself. Come on now. Honey, you, you got to cover up yourself. You got to protect your anointing. Come on now. Protect your anointing. Come on now. You got to protect yourself. Come on. And you got to, mm, 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 mm. protect this anointing on your life. Because you got to cover this thing. Come on now. Mm. Why? Because, for he said, for, for we wrestle not against flesh and blood. Look, look here, look here, look here, look here. Now, if you done done all that I done told you to do, look here now, look, look. You are not going to wrestle against flesh and blood. Look here. You are not wrestle against your mother, your father, mm, your servant. Mm, mm, my God, my God, my God. This, this is what it says happened. But against principalities. Mm, my God, my God. Mm. This is what you wrestle against. 
You wrestle against principalities. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. This is what you wrestle against. Uh-huh. Come on now. Mm. And look, he said, uh, against power, against the ruler of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Look, these are the things that's going to come up against you. Come on now, come on now. Because you're wrestling not against, huh, huh, flesh and blood. Look, look. Look, see, you you ain't you ain't against your mama. You're not coming against your daddy. You ain't coming against your, your leaders. Come on now, somebody. You rest against this here. The principalities. The prince of palities. Against the authorities, the rulers of this world. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The spiritual wickedness. You you fight, you fight against these things. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Look, don't you know every time. You turn around, when you try to do what's right, the enemy come up against you, start throwing stuff at you, things start to happen to you, you don't know what's happening, things that you try to get, and you sometimes you wonder why you're not getting because the enemy is a fighting you. Come on, it's a spiritual warfare. We are fighting warfare. We're having warfare. I ain't got nothing against my brothers and my sister. It's a spiritual battle. It's a warfare that we fighting up against. Glory be to God. See, you know, people think that people are fighting against one another. Mm -hmm. uh, no, we, we fighting against warfare. I, I, ain't, I ain't talking about you. I'm talking about the spirit behind you. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Because there's a spirit. Amen. Glory to God. And sometimes people can have those spirits on it. They don't even know they got them. So we're fighting warfare. Mm, my God, my God. We ain't wrestling against flesh and blood. Come on now. But against principalities. Mm, mm. These some things that sit in some high places. Mm, mm. Against the power. Against the ruler of the darkness. Mm, my God, my God. Of this world. Against spiritual wickedness. Mm, the wicked. Demons. Fighting against demons. Demonics. Oh yeah, they real. And you know what the sad thing about it? We don't like to talk about it. We don't like to talk about the, dem the demonics. Uh-huh. Those spirits. That we fight up against. Come on now somebody. Because some of you right now. Having a warfare. And you don't know what's going on. That demonic spirit. Up in your home. That you fighting up against. It, and you think it's your child. But it's a demonic spirit. You all got to know what you're fighting up against. It's a warfare. Yes it is. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes it is. That you fighting up against. Mm -hmm. And you think it's your child. But it's that enemy. The enemy uses your children. The enemy uses your spouse sometimes. You got to know what you're fighting up against. Amen. Glory be to God. Mm. My God, my God. It's a warfare here, saints. Yes, it is. It's a warfare. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Demons are real. Yes, it is. But I know that in the name of Jesus, every demon got to gotta flee. In the name of Jesus. But everybody don't know Jesus. Everybody don't know Jesus. When you don't know Jesus, you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't know how to fight when you don't know Jesus. Hallelujah, glory to God. You don't know what coming up against you when you when you when you when you when you don't know the Lord. Glory be to God. Hallelujah, glory to God. It's a warfare out here. Darkness covering the land. Darkness cover the earth. Amen. Those spiritual wickedness in high places. Amen. In high places. Amen. They sit in high places. Oh, yes, they do. They sit up in leadership. Uh-huh. They sit up in, in the government official. Yes, they do. Uh-huh. They're in high places. Mm hmm Ah, the rule of doctors trying to rule this world. Amen. Glory to God. Satanics. Spirits. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. These things that you're fighting up against. Hallelujah. They are real. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And all the time you might can't you can't see them, but you can feel them. You you know that they're there. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And one thing I found about someone, you know, they, they like coldness. They like coldness. They like dampness. Uh-huh. Glory to God. So one, one thing about them, they don't like light. For us as Christians, we walk in the light, not in darkness. Amen. We was in darkness, but now we're in the light because Jesus is the light. And he's the light of the world. Amen. Glory be to God. Amen. See, demons like darkness. They like night. They like darkness. You know, most folk, when they want when they want to do stuff that really ain't right, they like to travel in the nighttime. They like darkness. Uh-huh. That's why. Uh-huh. They like night. 
That's why they travel in that doctrine and do their thing. Because they don't want nobody to see them. Amen, glory to God. And you got some folks that walk in the light. You got some demons, them, some bold demons that walk in the light and do stuff in the light. Uh-huh. But you got you to gotta know what you're fighting up against. You got to know the thing that you're fighting up against in this hour. We're having a spiritual warfare. We're having a spiritual battle. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Ah, my God. And they sit in places that you never thought they were sitting in. Amen. You got to remember one thing. Everybody ain't saved. Everybody sitting in these offices is not saved. Mm, my God, my God. Ah, da, 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 my, sata. Mm, my God. Oh, Jesus. Mm, my, 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 my. Against the ruler of the darkness of the world of this world, it said against spirituals in high places. Mm. They sit in office. And everything they say, we say yes to. Even when we know it's not right. We say yes to. And I said we as a people, because not as a people, not everybody do. Uh-huh. That's right. They in high places. And they sit there and they rule, they rule. Amen. These officials, yeah, you know everybody ain't saved. They sit in these offices, they're not saved. Amen. Glory be to God. And they call, they call wrong, right, right, wrong, y'all. And you know I'm telling the truth. Amen. But somebody got to take a stand. Amen. Somebody got to be bold. And somebody got to be brave. Amen. And to stand for Christ. Amen. And say what's real. Amen. Glory to God. Because we don't, we're going we gonna to lose some of our children. Amen. Because they think it's right and it's wrong. Amen. Glory be to God. We can't accept everything that they throw out. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. We're in battle. Amen. Amen. Say it's not what That's not what life's about. Extends his hand, reveals his plan, and I know wherever he leads me, that's the place where he really needs me. And whether the chance be great or small, I'll give to him.